Since the 2002 election of the Turkish AKP government, Iran and Turkey have been emphasizing their common history, culture and economic ties. However, over the last couple of years, because of events in Syria and Egypt, and to a lesser degree in Iraq, the two Middle Eastern neighbors have not always seen eye to eye and have often been at loggerheads. And I think that uh, Turkey and Iran's growing trade and energy relations will uh, later lay the groundwork for a more stabilizing and moderating political relationship that's good for the whole Middle East. Uh, I think overall the uh, relationship between Turkey and Iran is uh, slowly but surely improving, uh, especially with the uh, election of the new president Rouhani in Iran. Uh, historically, the two countries have been somewhat rivals uh, throughout the region, uh, but now I think Iran is taking a very progressive step uh, towards the West and uh, overall uh, relationships are improving. And I think they will continue to improve. I think that the visit of Erdogan to Iran could really improve their relationship and in the end also the Middle East in general. So I hope that the ties will be stronger again. There is a feeling here in Turkey, evident on the ground, in the media and the government, that relationships between the two Middle Eastern neighbours could and should be better, despite discordant voices from Washington. In recent weeks, bilateral ties have been strengthened quite noticeably, so much so that the country's foreign ministers have visited each other's capitals and are in regular contact. The visit of Turkish Prime Minister Erdogan to Tehran this week has moved the economic relationship up one gear, and it is hoped that the visit of President Rouhani to Turkey next month will strengthen political and diplomatic ties so that Turkey and Iran will once again sing from the same song sheet. Nada Fekri, Press TV, Istanbul.